Thank you for having me in. Wonderful. W welcome, movie talk. <laughs> yeah. My most uh, enjoyable? Wow. There were so many days where I got to feel like the direct, like what I always thought it would be like to be a director, um, and that it was an adventure. It was the hardest thing I've ever attempted. And every day there's a different problem, a different uh, uh, puzzle, challenge. Right? challenge. Yeah. And so I would just say being outdoors and, and, and uh, getting to, to, every morning getting to feel the possibilities. You know, when I, uh, you know, figure out who the villains of the film or who, uh, what, what the, the, the monster is in a way, you know, I, I'll, I'll usually go uh, towards something where I, I haven't seen, I haven't seen that movie in a while. And I felt like, uh, you know, there have been a couple of UFO movies throughout the years, but very few in the horror genre. And uh, I, and so I felt like I had an opportunity here to uh, to do to to put on a, a big horror show. I think everyone will take something slightly different uh, from it, and part of part of, that's part of what's interesting to me. I think is going to see how different people interpret it. But what's at its core for me is that we as human beings have developed something of an addiction to spectacle. You know, whether it is, uh, you know, social media and, and you know, uh, seeing, seeing the top spectacle of the day, um, whether it is total, you know, distraction by media, um, yeah, I, that's that's what the that's what I I hope people po think about. My, the biggest preparation, yeah. in in terms of the uh, in terms of the practical effects. Yeah. Well, uh, you know, one of the things about flying saucers uh, is that. You know, you have a very simple, iconic shape and design that everyone recognizes and everyone believes is real. In some, some way, you know, or a lot of people believe in them. Yeah. Really believe, um, because it makes sense that, 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 uh, that there would be extraterrestrial life. Um, so I think everyone would be waiting to see what happens uh, when we get uh, inside uh, this UFO and so I won't give anything away, but I'll say the scene where we get inside, um, that's where the uh, most practical preparation occurs. Brother is out there. I don't think they take you. If you don't look at it. Help me! But don't look, don't look. 